Hey guys, what's going on? It is Dunbar Snack Bar here with The Walking Dead. A lot of you were just like, hey, you're talking about this on Twitter. Let's see what makes this game so great. Well, here we go. You guys saw the disclaimer at the beginning, so if you're not comfortable with graphic content or adult language, it might be time for you guys to go watch another video of mine. I'm going to post some other ones today. So, that being said, let's get to it here. The Walking Dead. Now, this is split up into five episodes, um, but... Of course, when I call it an episode, I'm not going through the entire video game episode because that can take like hours on end and I don't want to post that all at once. So, all right, I am in handcuffs. That's that's me, by the way. Play a guy named Lee Everett and we're going to learn a little bit about what's going on right now here in this uh, car ride. So, oh, take a look at me in that rearview mirror. Pretty quiet. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. I didn't do it. I'm just playing the game, buddy. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. But I didn't do it. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. That's what I'd say. Alright, so just taking a look around here is kind of cool. The interface is a little bit different here, but let's look in the rear view mirror now. I followed your case a little bit, you being a making boy and all. Oh, that makes me talk to him, okay. What do you think? I'm just glad I chose law and not order. Big messy trial like that, even if you was innocent, a lot of what happened can't ever be undone. Oh no, it's the cops! Any of that seem important to you? All of it, but that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? Ooh, that's a touchy subject. You want to know how I see it? Sure. Sure. It's the cops. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Uh-uh, I married the right woman. <gasps> Bad language. <sighs> that is a touchy subject. What's that all about? Man, helicopters, cops going in the other direction. Huh. How much you want to bet? Zombies. I bet you that's what it is. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you sit. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's got to stop, but that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Hey. Man. Man? <laughs> Not even close. They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do- Dude, watch it. out! This other time- Wow! Not looking at the road, that's what you get. Oh, we got some crazy stuff going on outside of the car. But I'm out. 
Alright. It's night. We're getting pretty close. Something's going on outside. I have no idea what it is. And I don't know if that police officer... What's up with him? But I'm going to wake up. Now in the back of the car. There's blood already? Thirsty. Yeah, I'd be thirsty ah. too. Zombie Fuck. apocalypse? Ah, oh, it's my leg. Okay. Alright, so since it's my leg, I'm not too worried about things. But, oh man. Looks like he's been dragged too. Why the hell did he have his gun out? Because it's zombies. Hey, hey officer. Are you alright? I'm still cut back here. All right. Yeah, it totally looks like he's been dragged, so I bet zombies are around here already. Officer? Okay. Oh, that doesn't look good. So what am I supposed to do now? He wasn't ejected from the car. He's not moving. Yeah, I could have told you that. All right. What am I supposed to do? Oh, kick the window. I can do that. It's a piece of cake. Do it all the time. Okay, maybe I don't. I need to drag myself out that window. All right, move forward. I think I can get out now. So I am now in the outside world. But I still got these handcuffs on. Yeah, that would hurt. I would not want to walk on that that leg if it's cut open like that. So limping along seems about right. Man, I'm worried about heading over to the cop. Because if he's been bitten by the zombies, he's already one, but there's a shotgun. Looks empty. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. I don't want to Freaking leave the shotgun. Ooh, there's a shell. I'm picking that up. Alright, so I can hold on to that. So I'm alright. Let's just get over to the cop. Find out what's going on. Officer? Gross. He's already like gray and... That's not a good sign. Been dragged out. He's gray. Uh, I dropped the keys right in front of his face. If he is a zombie, he can just like bite my hands right now, and this game's done and over with. But I don't think so. There's plenty more game ahead. I'm not gonna die right now. I should finally get them off. Oh, well, I got one off. Now I gotta get the other cuff off. There we go. Oh, what's that? Officer. Oh, what? Holy shit. Yeah, I'm getting away. You better believe I'm getting away. I think I'm backing up towards the... Yep, I'm back at the car. There's the shotgun. I've already picked up the shell. So all I gotta do is just pick that up. And you can go ahead and put the shell in. Come on, man. You gotta hurry. I gotta pick it back up again. There we go. Oh, you are going down, man. You are going down. Whew. That's nasty. Oh, who is that? Off there in the horizon. That's creepy. Go get someone. There's been a shooting. What if that's the person in charge of all this, you know? Oh, now I hear other zombies. Where are they? I have no idea where these guys are. Or what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Oh, man, there they are. Yeah, get up, Lee. Oh, of course I got to trip over the body. That's nasty. You would think that even though you had a deep gash in your leg like that, you would still try to do everything you could to run. <laughs> Gotta run, Lee. All right. 
Alright. Here's the fence. If I can get over the fence, I'll be safe. But I gotta be looking back instead of running. And you're a man, you can get yourself over. Ah, there we go. I think I'm safe. Now I'm in somebody's backyard. Which, that might be a good thing. Hopefully this wall holds him back. I can't run too much farther than this. Oh, gunshots. Of course that's going to go ahead and draw them over that direction. Because zombies like sound. That's just how it works. Why are you heading towards the fence? I'd be getting as far away from that fence as I could. Hello? Anybody? Alright. So things look pretty peaceful here. I'm going to try and see if I can go into this house. Might be able to find something in here, like food, some water. Who knows? Maybe this will end up being a place. Anybody's home. Place I can uh, get some shelter. Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. Doesn't sound like it. Hello? There's something going on. Screw it. I'm just gonna go in. Do it. There we go. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? And that's where I'm going to leave it for this episode. So I'm going to get some more, of course, up later on. If you guys think something like this would be entertaining, I thought this game was great. So um, this just gives you a small taste of what is going to happen next. So if you guys want to see more, just go ahead and comment below and let me know. If this is your first video, subscribe, you guys. If you haven't already, you guys can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, all that great stuff. Just make sure you check out the description below. But again, you guys, thank you so much for watching this. Uh, and, I, of course, you guys know that I hope you have a good one.